All right, what's up ladies and gentlemen? In this video, I'm gonna be explaining to you how long a lucid dream lasts. So how much time it takes in real time and perceived time. And also I'm gonna explain about how, to, you can, how you can make a lucid dream last longer. Okay, it's, very, it's fairly simple. There are some things you can do uh, which will make your dream not only seem like it's lasting longer, but also make it actually take more time in, in the real world. So let's get right into it. So basically, when you lucid dream, you are in what's known as REM sleep, rapid eye movement sleep. Okay, and uh, this stage of sleep is where your your eyes will make rapid movements under your eyelids as you're asleep, in order to simulate the dreams that you're having. Okay, and almost all dreams happen in this REM sleep. So, as you sleep, you have a sleep what's known as sleep cycles, which comprise 90 minutes. Towards the end of that 90 minutes, you'll have a, a, a period of REM sleep, which can be anything from 10 minutes up to an hour. Um, so essentially, a, a lucid dream or a normal dream can last the duration of that REM sleep. So say if in your first sleep cycle you have a REM period of 10 minutes, you could have a dream for 10 minutes. Uh, if you wait until later on in the evening, in the um, night, sorry, until one of the later stages of sleep, towards the early hours of the morning, when I suggest you do uh, lucid dreaming, you can have a lucid dream up to an hour. So it really depends which stage of the night you're in uh, and how long you're staying in the lucid dream for. Now, what usually happens is people will wake themselves up in the middle of a dream by getting too excited or by you know losing focus or whatever the case may be. Um, and that is one of the most common mistakes people make is they have a lucid dream, they get lucid, but then they suddenly wake themselves up. Um, so th I've made other videos about this. There's some, there's some things you can do to sort of stay in the lucid dream for long, longer periods of time. Uh, but yeah, generally speaking, you, you will have a dream for up to the, the duration of your REM sleep. So say if it's 10 minutes, 20 minutes, up to an hour um, of real time. Now, the interesting thing is that when you're in a dream, the perception of time changes completely. So you could be in a dream and you could dream for 10 minutes, but to you as the dreamer, it would feel like potentially weeks or even years. Uh, and the reason for this is because when you dream, uh, you don't really have a very good perception of time. So you don't really have a good understanding of how much actual time is passing uh, because you're experiencing things in a different reality. It's almost like you're watching a film of time going past, but you're not really aware of how much time is going past. So think, for example, if you were to watch a time lapse of, say, two, three years, okay, uh, you'd be aware of the time passing in real time as you're watching the video, maybe two or three minutes, but you would also be aware that you're watching two or three years worth of time go past in a video. That's what is basically happening in a lucid dream, but you're not aware of how much real time is passing. So to you, the dreamer, it just feels like you're experiencing that length of time, two or three years, for example. Um, so yeah, I hope this answers your question. Uh, this was an anon anonymous question that was sent in. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions, please leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe.